All right, trainers, it's time now to continue our journey in Let's Go Pikachu. We got the boulder badge in the last episode. So now, we're going to start making our way to Mount Moon. You looked at me, didn't you? I most certainly did not. She's got an oddish. A quick attack. And quick attack again. Another trainer down. Now over here we have what's called a coach trainer. Uh, coach trainers, what they do is they stand in various places throughout the region to train uh, other trainers. And you know what? I think we're going to battle this person. And this coach trainer's name is Kareem, and he's got a Bulbasaur. Level 11. Okay, uh... I think we're gonna have to make a switch here. Alright, Pidgey. Let's go. And we use Gust. Just again. And Bulbasaur is down. And our own Bulbasaur goes to level 8. And we got to revive. Now, let's see. We use a potion here on Pidgey. And one on Pikachu there. And that's that. Pikachu, electrify this kid's Spiro. Level 11 for Otters. We have an item down here, another potion. And three Pokeballs. Alright. That'll definitely come in handy. Camper Victor, he's got a Nidoran. It's the male Nidoran. And 
poison sting didn't do anything. Nice try, Nidoran, but you are down and out. Get another Spiro here, which I guess we'll catch just for the, for the sheer fact that we need to level up Bulbasaur. And Bulbasaur is now at level 9, and Pidgey wants to learn Quick Attack, which we will definitely learn. Uh, sand Attack. We'll get rid of that. And Bulbasaur learns Leech Seed. That Pikachu would have leveled up there, but... Oh well. Face palm four away this time. Wait, dear God, honestly, did you push me? No! Why would you think that? You make a false accusation. I go after your dear am. Goodbye, Nidoran. And now Pikachu's at level 12. Double team, huh? No, I think we're going to stick with what we have. Oh, what's this? Oh, that's a sand shrew there. <laughs> and there's a sand shrew. Yes, we are wearing shorts. Who wears shorts, shorts? I wear shorts, shorts. Yeah, I'm a bad singer. I don't think it's even close to how that song's supposed to go. We got that little kick takes care of Ricotta. Pikachu is only level 5, so it's no match for Pikachu, for Pikachu's strength. Okay. And got another revive.
Do you want to paint it for Tina Mount Moo? Yeah, why don't we go ahead and do that? And you just send out a meow. Level 13. Okay. And there's Meowth's signature move, Payday. And another double kick. And some extra money. And we get the paid ATM. And we've got an item over here. A skate rope. That'll come in handy for us. Now we're going to go over here. And this Spiro and this Sandshrew, I am going to take out from the party here. Here, it's the Magikarp guy. Yeah, Magikarp is a horrible, horrible Pokemon. I mean, it evolves into Gyarados at level 20, which is nice. But as a Magikarp, it is one of the most useless things in the entire world. Do not buy it. Besides, if you get Magikarp for free, with a rod later on. You can also catch wild Gyarados in here. So yeah, we're not going to go for the Gyarados, but what we are going to do is we're going to make our way inside Mount Moon. Actually, wait a second. Hold on a minute. What is that? That's Team Rocket's Meowth that's up there. Why is it sleeping on the job? Looks like there's nothing here. Let's just search further in. You, you were eavesdropping on us just now, weren't you? Meowth, you were supposed to be keeping watch. Yeah. We know it was riff. Work. Wow. Those guys do not joke around. And oh boy, we gotta do that. Alright. You know what? I'll just. Excuse me. These bats do not like to stay still. There we go. We got a Z-Bat.
Zubat, of course, is poison flying type Pokemon. Which we are not going to use. Alright, you know what? I think we're going to leave here. And that is where we're going to end this episode. So, we will start the actual exploration of Mount Moon next time. Thank you very much for watching. We'll see you then.